A rare sight indicator. Red tail hawks have made their nest in downtown. A live look, in fact, at that nest right now. Even more rare, the birds chose their home right under our barn citizens cam. WAD Steve Nichols shows you how the discovery came about. A new family has decided to call Decatur home. A few weeks back, something bizarre happened. I actually observed a red tail flying in and uh, had a stick in his beak, and he landed on the, the upper platform of the fire escape. And as it turns out, home has been built directly below our weather camera on top of the barn citizens building. And, uh, the pair of red tails have uh, uh, laid a, an egg. We're, we're suspecting there are two eggs. Hawks and most raptors typically call more rural areas home. Urbanized red tails is not it's not an unheard of thing. It's just not a very common thing. Uh, so they're pretty secretive birds when they nest. They're pretty secretive when they build their nests. Uh, but these guys, um, they pretty much are used to everything. But this pair doesn't seem to be bothered by the downtown traffic and people. She's actually watching us right now. But one thing they do not tolerate, other red tail hogs. Looks like another red tail came in. There was no combat going on. There was, it wasn't actually screaming, but I think these two red tails were just kind of flying around going, hey, uh, they're stay out of downtown. We own this place right now, so. These hawks have a very healthy food supply and they don't want to share it with anybody. But our downtown red tails have done something pretty unique. Um, they become masters at hunting pigeons. And this is what's so unique about that is because a red tail hawk is in a family of hawks called Budios. And Budios are not really built for hunting pigeons. They're built for hitting things on the ground. But these two have adapted and they have a strategy and tactics for taking down these downtown pigeons. With a stable food supply and a secure nest, it appears that this family has a fighting chance. If these guys hatch, I think that's the next step in watching these and this little drama unfold. Do these eggs hatch? And if they do hatch, do these chicks grow up and they fledge? And uh, then, then I think we can all go, okay, now what are we gonna do next year? Now only time will tell if this family makes it, but we'll be here. We'll be here watching to see if they produce another generation of red-tailed hawks. Indicator. This is Steve Nichols, WAND. What an opportunity. Here's another live look at the camera pointing right into the nest. We're streaming the camera Monday through Friday from 7 a.m. until 10 a.m. on our Facebook page, WAND News Center 17. Check it out.